peace, and mercy of God. And his blessings. President Joe Biden's statement about the bombing of the hospital in Gaza and his claim that it occurred as a result of a failed Palestinian missile launch. It is a ridiculous statement. Why should there be any doubt that the bombing of the National Arab Hospital occurred because of an Israeli bombing? Since last week, the murderous regime has been trying to erase the Palestinians from existence. Israel targets Palestinians all the time and has even tried to eliminate all Palestinians over the past 70 years. Today, after continuous airstrikes day and night, Israel blames the Palestinians for the hospital bombing. Biden's narrative is based on statements by Netanyahu and the Pentagon. Netanyahu is lying about everything. If Biden wants to use the Pentagon to give credibility to his story, we have not forgotten how the Pentagon and other American institutions lied about the presence of weapons of mass destruction in Iraq. Iran. The last lie came in Biden's claim that he saw pictures of Hamas beheading children. The White House later retracted those statements and admitted that there was no evidence that such an act had been committed. The question is how can Biden lie in such a blatant manner and with such an open face? The essence of the matter is that all of these atrocities committed by Israel against the Palestinians stem from American support for Tel Aviv. If the American government had withdrawn its support for Israel and stopped all forms of military support for that regime, Israel would not have been able to carry out ethnic genocide and mass murder of Palestinians with impunity. The United States of America must admit this and tell us the truth. The truth is that Netanyahu and his army are the real terrorists. The United States blatantly supports terrorists. What would the United States be in this case? Thank you all.